Hello, we are going to introduce the Roman numerals system. We will look which letter represents which numeral, how we combine numerals to make larger numeral and where to subtract numerals. So, Roman numerals are represented by seven different letters. I representing 1, V representing 5, X representing 10, L representing 50, C representing 100, D representing 500, M representing 1000. So, how do we use these seven letters to make thousands of different numbers? Well, we combine them together in order to make a new numeral. For instance, 2. We have 2i, that means 1 and 1. So, 1 plus 1 equals to 2. Let's take one more example of 12. We have x which will represent 10 and 2i will represent 2. So 10 plus 2 equals to 12. One more example. So it's 27. So we have double x so 1 x equals to 10 so double x is 10 plus 10 so we have 20 and v representing 5 and double i will represent 1 plus 1 2 so we have 20 plus 5 plus 2 equals to 27 You may have also noticed that the larger number always going to descending order from left to right. This tells you must add the numerals together. However, this is not always the case as we see in the next part. So now we are going to subtraction. In this cases, larger number does not go in front of smaller number. For example, 4, where we have i before v, that means 1 before 5. So, smaller number before the larger number we simply subtract. So, taking 1 from 5, it's 4. Let's take example of 9, where we have i, that is 1, and x, that is 10. So, taking 1 from 10, 9. Here we have one more example where we have x, l. So smaller number before larger number that's uh, l 50. So taking 10 from 50 is 40. Okay, let's take one more example. This is uh, 400 and 90 this is a big number so we have the roman numerals cd xc so let's break the entire number into two part cd and xc so smaller number c and then the larger number d 500 so
so we are going to take 100 from 500 so that's 400 same principle applies for the next part we are going to taking 10 from 100 so 90 so 400 and 90 so that's the number 400 and 90 right there are only six instances where we subtract numerals IV that is 4 that means we are taking 1 from 5 IX that is 9 so we are taking from we are taking 1 from 10 and X L that is we are taking 10 from 50 X C that is we are taking 10 from 100 that is 90 C D that is we are taking 100 from 500 that is 400 C M that is we are taking 100 from 1000 that is 900 right so have a quick look on the numerals from 1 to 10 1 that will represent i in the roman numerals 2 will represent double i in the roman numerals 3 will represent 3i 4 will represent i v 5 will represent v 6 v i 7 v i i 8 v i i i 9 i x this is also a second instance of subtraction 10 x so this is it uh, please like subscribe and share don't hesitate to ask any questions in the comment section below